Hey everybody, Kyrie 91 hanging out with you, boy oh boy, are we going to have big fun today playing some art EverQuest Project 1999. So, um, when we last left off, we had just hit, uh, level, what level did we just hit? Is that more words? I want those. We had just hit level 49. And... Uh, right now, I guess I'm just looking for something to do. Um, I really don't have anything that I want to work on. I, I guess I could go to, um, oh, I'm in North Freeport, by the way, right now. That's the bank of North Freeport, in case you don't know the area. Um, I'm thinking I just want to go to maybe Greater Fate Arc and just, uh, do some power leveling for some people over there, I guess, is maybe what I'll do. Uh, how much inventory space do I have with me? I know I brought, like, noob gear to give away today. I don't have much space at all. Alright, well, I'll give away that noob gear, and then I will uh, go into Crushbone and help some people out with some stuff. That sounds like a good plan. Down to good old West Freeport. Got Kristen Charcoal over here. I'm looking for some small, for some cloth, um, for some cloth, like, sandals, because I don't have a foot piece, and I just want something in my inventory. Look at my foot piece over here is totally empty. I have nothing, and, uh, I feel like somebody probably has some cloth sandals I could use here, but, oh, look at it. It's an ass kicker, but she didn't make it. You know what, guys? I gotta tell you, this, where I'm at right now, this little newbie area of West Freeport... This is, like, where my heart lives in this game, okay? This is it for me. Like, I, I, I love this. I love levels 1 and 2, and I guess a little bit of level 3, maybe. Right here, um, killing bats, killing fire beetles, killing large rats, death fist pawns, and decaying skeletons. It's, and I like it right here in, uh, right here in, in West Freeport. It's just, it's a magical time of the game for me. And I like East Common Lands, too. I like this whole area. The whole eastern part of the Antonica continent. Um, you know, Common Lands, Desert of Ro, uh, uh, Freaking um, Nectulos, Neriac. I don't know. I just like this whole area right here. I think it's freaking cool. So I guess if I'm going to Greater Fade Arc, I don't know why I'm still running. Because I can just port to, Greater, to uh, Butcher Block right now. So I guess that's what I'll do. I'm, I think I'm, I think I'm bound and over there. Where am I bringing spells? Ring of Butcher, where are you? Alright, so I'm going to need a snare. I'm going to need, a, I won't need that. I will need, however, Skin Like Nature. That's my new one. I finally get to use it. Uh, Shield of Thorns is my new one. I'll get to use that. And Thorncoat is also my new one. I will finally get to use this as well. So I think that's what I'm going to need for my purposes. I don't think I'll need anything else. So let's head over to Butcher Block. Why not? Okay. Where the frick are we? Here we go. Ah, Butcher Block. This one, butcher the, the zones like Butcher Block and Fade Arc hold a different place in my heart because that is when uh when I started playing on Excelio actually this is sort of where I hung out um I on live I really it's weird to say that I had a level 43 magician and I never went to greater fade arc and I never went to I never heard this song um I never went to uh to um Butcher Block or uh, uh, Crushbone or Unrest or any of that. So, yeah. It's just weird to think that I played that much of the game and never went to, like, pretty common zones like Greater Fade Arc. Um, but then when I started playing on Excelio, I, I made him a Wood Elf, of course. Handsome guy. Look at him. Look at him go. Anyways, I started playing on Excelio. I made him a Wood Elf and uh, obviously started in Kelethon. And spent a lot of time in Greater Fade Arc and Crushbone and did all that stuff. And I had never done it before. I had never grouped in Crushbone before. I had never, uh, you know, well, 
Grooved and Crush Bone, I guess. I knew about the uh, Death Fist Orcs, the ones in East Commons, but I had no idea. I knew the Crush Bone Orcs existed, but I'd never killed them before. So it was, uh, it was pretty darn cool uh, to get to know this. It was. That's why I like Project 1999 so much. I, my experience with EverQuest, even though I did play a lot of it on live. I pretty much kept to like stuff that I already knew. Even if I were to make a new character, I never would. I would always want it to be either a human or a dark elf, so I could be right by Freeport. Um, and uh, yeah, I would always kind of hang out in that area. And I, I missed out on like this great big world, uh, you know, all this cool stuff. But then live got kind of out of control with incidents, dungeons, and. Um, the, the bazaar, I can understand the point of the bazaar, but I kind of don't like what it did to the player market. So, because like when you have something like the bazaar, it drives prices down. Items that normally would be sold for a lot, you'll find somebody selling them for like dirt cheap. And then the people who sell it for the normal price will never actually sell the item. Uh, and, you know, I guess that's good when you're a low B and you're broke and you can go get yourself a, you know... Uh, advisor robe or something for like 15 platinum uh, but I don't know I don't really like that I like that you know it's a status symbol to be able to save up the money to get that you know I love this song I don't know can you guys hear it can you guys hear this harp song I love this freaking song No, 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 Okay. I'm looking for the lifts. I can never find them. I mean, if I can find, if I can find Kelethon, which I'm underneath it right now, here's a lift. What is this? Newbie lift. So once I've found one lift, I can usually find the rest because pod lift should be right here. This guy tried to fight the priest of discord. It didn't go well. And then orc lift should be up this way. So we'll see. Once I find one, I can... Oh, boy. That guard just took quite a tumble. Regards me as an ally. Thank you, Lieutenant Leafstalker. Very nice of you. I regard you as an ally. So what I want to do is I want to go up here real quick. And I'm just going to uh, give away some free shit to uh, some newbies. I'm going to hopefully make their day, but as twinked as everyone is, the, the meager free stuff that I offer, it doesn't usually make anyone's day anymore. They're like, oh, fucking plus two int rings. That's cool. I already got plus 10 int rings, so thank you, I guess, for nothing. Ominous music. There's the entrance to Crushbone. I overshot. Oh, I was looking for Orc Hill and I missed it. <clears throat> This is Orc Hill right here, I think. There we are. Hello, Orc Hillians. First time casting Shield of Thorns. You're gonna die. Good thing I showed up, huh? <laughs> uh, kill them. <laughs> All right. There you go. Come on. Why aren't they dying? I guess I'll just start this here then. Right? Because. There we go. Alright. So here we are. Or kill. Cool place to be. What's your deal, Melsa? Crack staff. What are you? Are you a. Are you a chamois? Are you a sham wow? Okay. 
Okay, I got something for you, ShamWow. Come on, respond to me, please. I know you're a ShamWow. You don't even have to tell me now, Melsa. Put those... Oh, no! <laughs> I gave her the wrong one. The Give me back the non-wiz one, please. I will give you a whiz one. Come on. Come on. There you go. Take it! Man, she took a while to do that. Somebody give me shit like that, man. I'd take it. What are you? Oh, you will not fit into small small bronze boots, will you? Um, banded leggings. Where is that person? That my I love that bear helmet that the barbarians always seem to have. What are you wearing for leggings? What is this? Why can't I see that? Can you wear this? Can you wear this, Talia? Put it on. I want to see how it looks. Does it even look different? It doesn't look any different, does it? She hasn't put it on yet. Oh, there you go. Looking sharp. And I got this bladesman's axe. Looks like she has something better, though. What's she have? Oh, yeah, she's got something better. She's got the Kuznar Kuzinich, Dennis Kucinich. She's got the Dennis Kucinich. What about you? What about you, Mr. Druid? Are you a Druid? You are a Druid, I can tell, because you have a splintering club. So, let's give you some rings. We need some really big rings. I got a really big team. We're going to get some really big rings. Fucking, I think I gave that person strength rings instead of wisdom rings, didn't I? Oh, well. I guess they're going to have a little bit better strength. I don't have any more wisdom rings. I guess I only had two, or maybe I only had one. Where is you? What do you got for rings? What is this? Black and pearl silver ring? Why don't I give you a strength ring? See how nice Ixalio is to everyone? How much, how good of how good care I take of everybody. How Norath is a better place because of me. Okay. Oh boy, Lysha's in trouble. I'll save you, Lysha. Oh, my thorn coat wore off, and my strength of stone's about to wear off. Give you a new shield of thorns here. Should help out a little bit. Oh, crap. I'm encumbered all of a sudden. All right, guys. Um, I'll be back. All right. Finally found someone to give some of these rings to. And there you go. Have fun there, Ryer. No problem. So I just gave this guy this axe, this bladesman's axe, and a couple of these strength rings. I'm trying to get rid of this stuff uh, for anyone who needs it. I don't just want to give it away to whoever. I want it to go to someone that will actually make use of it, and this guy says he will. So um, Apparently he died and lost his corpse and lost all the... You know, the basic cloth and leather gear that he had acquired. So I feel bad for him and glad I could help out. Ominous music beginning. That's how you know. That's how you know. That you are about to zone in. To Crushbone. I'm going to take this guy's shoes in exchange for those rings. I have no shoes right now. 
and I'm tired of looking for cloth sandals. <laughs> I, just, I seriously just took this guy's shoes. That really just happened, y'all. Ooh, still warm. Thanks, buddy. All right, well, I got some shoes at the deal. Worked out well. I'm down to one last silver amber ring. And it goes to whoever can tell me the name of Mario Lopez's character from Saved by the Bell. And then tell me whether or not he's related to Sergeant Slate from East Commons. Is anyone even going to respond to that silly thing I just did there? I don't think so. It's probably a bit too... Probably a bit too, uh, too silly. I'm sorry, Lysha, that's incorrect. Any other guesses? Ah! <laughs> AC Slater. Oh. Correct. <laughs> Where are you so I can bring your prize? Your peers. I spelled prize wrong. I'm not going to fix it. I'm leaving it that way. That's how I spell prize now. <laughs> I should do this more often. I, should, I shouldn't just give shit away. I should make people answer stupid questions about like fucking like... Saved by the Bell or like Fresh Prince of Bel Air or something like that. Let's take a look. Yeah, you can have it. You don't have anything already on you. Finish fighting so I can give you this shit. Come on. Turn off auto attack, you. <laughs> so, <laughs> Winston says, so are they related? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? You dummy, where'd you go? I'm trying to give you free shit. There you go. All right. Uh, anyways, guys, I'm going to power level some people here because this I'm having fun here in Crushbone at level 49. Uh, so thank you so much for joining me. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Um, this was just an episode for me to feel good about myself because of all the shit that I go out and buy and then just give away to strangers. So bye, everyone. I love group wolf form. <laughs> Look at this. Let's tag this whole group here. <clears throat> Uh, 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 uh. All right. <laughs>